In this video, I want to show you how to display gravity form entries on any poster page using your conductor widget. You can also do this in the query builder, and I'm also going to use the display add-on pack today for the enhanced table display. So let's go ahead and drop in our conductor widget. We're going to select from gravity form entries. I only have one form on this test site, so I'm going to select the form. It's called test. I'm going to leave everything else uh, as is right now. I'm going to switch over to the table display, and I'm going to enable our, in, our table headings and the enhanced display, which will give us a few more features here, and then hide all of the core WordPress meta fields, and now search for gravity forms in the, cust in the custom field search bar and add the fields from our form. And you can see all of the information that's available to us in uh, the Gravity Forms add-on. But I'm just going to add our fields in. And you can see here if I wanted to add in the IP address, uh, the entry form ID, the entry ID, when it was created, all that fun stuff, I could do that. And you can see right here on the right-hand side our table display. And now I'm simply going to reorder this. I'm going to go name, website, comment. And there you have it. You can see it just sort of takes shape right there in this nice uh, table display with all the columns here. If I didn't want to display one, for instance, if I just wanted to quickly hide that file field, I could remove it totally or just hide it, uh, which would not display any of the data there. And I can sort of sort by the column and search and filter that down as well. It's the Gravity Forms add-on for a conductor. You can get it at conductorplugin.com.